Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Crypto Explorer. Today, I'm going to do a video tutorial on how to mine Bitcoin Gold. Um, if you're not familiar with Bitcoin Gold, it is a fork of Bitcoin that happened at the end of October. And it is set to launch in, in a little over a day, a day and an hour right now. So Bitcoin Gold, um, their whole purpose is basically um, to make a cryptocurrency that everyone can mine and not just those with uh, the high-end ASIC miners that, are, that is uh, very popular with mining farms. And what it does is it allows it to... Um, it, it basically uh, uh, decentralizes the control of their network from the miners um, and puts more control uh, to individuals who are using their GPU to mine. So uh, let's see here. This is their website, uh, bitcoingold.org. You want to make sure that um, you go to the official sites um, because there are a lot of... Um, phishing sites out there that are um, they want to try to trick you to putting your private keys of your uh, Bitcoin wallet um, so that they can get access to your Bitcoin gold or your Bitcoin wallet uh, but um, just make sure you go to the official Bitcoin gold sites when um, you're doing anything uh, with it so um, let's go down first um, right now you cannot mine Bitcoin gold um, until um, the main net is launched, but you can get your hardware and your mining software ready for the, the network to launch so that you can uh, mine Bitcoin Gold immediately. Um, in order to mine Bitcoin Gold, you will need a wallet address. Um, as of right now, let's go down here, there is no PC or Mac wallets. They do have um, wallets for Android and iOS. Free wallet, They um, these are the wallets that will support Bitcoin Gold. Free wallet is available for Android and iOS. That's the one I, I plan to use. And then once the main network is up, you can generate a wallet address and you will need that wallet address in order to mine. So. I've already created one. It's a fake address. It's not a real address, but it's in the format for Bitcoin um, Gold. And um, what you'll do is, once you create that wallet and get your address, you need to, to copy and paste it into your computer uh, so you can mine Bitcoin Gold. And then what it'll do is it'll send the your whatever you mined into that address. Now. There are a lot of exchanges that will support Bitcoin Gold, but I am not certain if you can mine directly to those addresses. Most exchanges you cannot. So let's get to mining. First thing you want to do is go to the official Bitcoin Gold mining pool. Um, there are other mining pools, but for this tutorial, we're going to use the uh, official one, which is pool.gold. I actually had it open up right here, but I'm going to close this. And then it takes you to the official Bitcoin mining pool, and it's in testnet, right? So let's go to te the testnet. When when it's live, you may have to change some parameters, but right now, if you go to the testnet, you can actually make sure you test your mining equipment. So once it's live, you can make sure um, that you are able to mine. And then you go to getting started. And it's a little slow, but it looks like a lot of people are trying to test their equipment before the main net is launched. And then you, depending on what kind of uh, graphics card you have, if it's an AMD graphics card like a Radeon or a, a, a um, NVIDIA type of graphics card, you would download it. So I'm going to download CUDA Miter for NVIDIA because that's what I have. 
Now, here's the thing. In Google Chrome, it will block it. So this is for Linux, this is for Windows. So we're going to do the Windows, and I'll just show you. So it did block it. So you need to copy and paste this address. Now, if you're not using Google Chrome and you're using um, Edge, you won't have this problem. So click Download, and then Save. Now, you also want to make sure your antivirus is turned off. Uh, mining software is is um, flagged by most antivirus. Now, if you're not comfortable turning off your antivirus, then by all means, don't do it and um, just don't mine. But if you're okay with it um, and you want to mine, um, it does need to be turned off. So we're going to open the folder and then we're going to extract it. Right click, extract all, extract. And then we're going to open this BTG folder, BTG NVIDIA Miner. And then you're going to see a start file. If you right click it and select edit, and then you're going to see the parameters here. So this user is your Bitcoin gold address. I'm going to replace it with the one I created here because I want it to pay uh, my address. And, and paste. Now, this worker, dot worker, if you have multiple mining rigs or multiple uh, computers mining, you may want to. Uh, um, put some kind of identifier uh, to see their stats later on. So I'm just going to put home. Um, this is the pool, the mining pool, and the mining uh, and the port. Um, depending on the pool you're going to mine, they may change. So um, And also when the test net, when the main net goes live. So you may have to change this, the server name and the server port, but we'll leave it at that now, uh, what it is right now, and click save. And then we can close it up, and then click start. Windows uh, will prompt you. You just click more info and run anyway. And you can see that the miner is started. And what we're gonna do is, while that's going, I'm gonna copy our mining address. And you can see it's accepting shares. And then we're gonna go back to the Bitcoin gold mining website. Let's hit back. And then you're going to see uh, the graph stats over here, if it will load. So you can see it detected. But let's see the graphical stats and the I'm going to open a new tab for worker stats. Oh, here we go. So these are the stats of the whole mining pool. So as you can see, it's still testnet mining. So if you want to see your um, mining stats, go to worker stats. Come on and load. And then paste your address here and click lookup. And let's go back to the mining software down here. You see he's already accepted a couple of shares. So we should have some stat from our miner. And just waiting. Now, if you were fortunate enough to have some uh, Bitcoin during the Bitcoin Gold fork uh, at the end of October, you will see, you will be able to have that much in Bitcoin Gold. Oh, let's refresh. Oh, there you go. You see some stats. So this is me earlier testing, and let's uh, 
see right now. So we are um, mining, and you can see there's some balances and all that stuff.